Despite occupying senior roles in the national government, member for Lay John Rosso maintains that his priority is his electorate. Apart from being the Lay MP, Rosso is also PNG's Deputy Prime Minister, Minister for Lands and Physical Planning and also the Minister for Labour and Immigration. Well, in my capacity as a Deputy Prime Minister, I do work for our government, uh, country and stuff like that. You've always got to fix your backyard and that's your home. And that's the place you all grew up. Wherever you grew up in a, in a settlement or you grew up in a suburb or you grew up uh, wherever in the communities around the lake, you've got to fix your home. And I think we've done well in the last six years with all your help. And the business houses and Rosso said while tangible development can be seen in the once neglected Lay City, which used to be called the pothole city of PNG, more work needs to be done. The Lay MP said today the streets of Lay are a lot safer. Petty crime rates have reduced due to foot patrols by police reservists under a partnership with the Lay City Authority and Royal PNG Constabulary. Infrastructure has improved and so has people's attitudes. A lot of things we're doing to improve uh, our community and the community spirit is the biggest thing. Every time we do something, you always have that community spirit. You don't really see it in too many other towns. In Lay, you have the business houses always, always behind you when you do something, even though it's struggling times. <clears throat> During the launch of the Rosso mountain bike race on Saturday, the Lay MP apologized to his electorate for having limited time with them. However, he gave the assurance that with their help, Lay will be restored to its glory days.